Hey guys, my name is Andrew. I work as a PT down in Melbourne under AG Fitness. Now, I've been in the industry for the last six years. Uh, what I specialize in is uh, mostly uh, MMA style uh, fitness. So more in terms of group training, also kettlebell training, and other sort of strength basis training as well. Now, uh, the reason why I'm here today is because I'm going to be going into the unboxing, or should I say unraveling, of the Spectre Blend. Okay. Now the reason why I got myself a Spectre Blend is because, uh, well, what happened was that I was uh, looking for one. I uh, checked in the US, they uh, had one called uh, Vitamix, it was actually going for close to seven, eight hundred dollars. I found it a bit too steep. Apparently this is uh, 1500 watts, so it just uh, has a lot of horsepower to basically crush out everything or anything. And just on the basis where, uh, yeah, just want to get most out of it. All right, let me just set this up. And then from there, we're just gonna have a bit of a test run. It's just ingredients for uh, basically a recovery protein shake. Now, usually in, uh, as you know, with training aspects in terms of recovery, recovery is very important to make sure that uh, lactic acid doesn't accumulate, or should I say in terms of fatigue, uh, doesn't uh, settle during the next 24 to 48 hours, and obviously uh, stretching. But uh, hopefully with this uh, sort of uh, uh, compound of uh, mixtures, it's going to uh, make me fully recover from a hardcore uh, sort of training session that I'm gonna do uh, myself either in uh, mixed martial art training or even strength training. So we're going to start off with this is going to place all the ice cubes in here and all right got the almonds yes very good protein source and we're just going to place in uh, one scoop of the recovery protein powder so let's just uh, get that sorted over here ooh it smells very banana banana -y. And uh, just to add an extra uh, potency of bananas, we'll just say uh, two. Let's get that sorted. And last but not least, some almond milk. Okay, just making sure that's nice and firm. Okay, it's on, and let's roll. Basically, this blender just owned that ice, as well as everything else in there. All right, let's see how it tastes now. Cool. Wow, look at the flavor of that. Mmm, very nice. I'll just have a taster, see what it's like. Uh, very fresh. The ice is uh, basically broken down to, uh, yeah, water texture. Tastes really good. There's no uh, chunks or whatnot. Usually uh, with blenders you'll find that uh, with the nuts and stuff, it uh, has little chunks, but yeah, it basically has nothing in it, as you can see. So, yeah, I'm actually...